um, began using uh, an in-house uh, process in 2006, and and it uh, was was acceptable. Um, the the results I got were okay with our internal auditors. Uh, the numbers were acceptable with OCC. I don't think there was a review that uh, the analysis uh, calculation we came up with, the reserve requirement, was ever questioned. But um, it, uh, from our standpoint, uh, it, it just we we felt like there was a better way. Two factors there: the changing. Uh, with the uh, with the regulatory environment, and then my nearness to retirement, uh, and and looking at those two components, uh, we started looking for a software package. And I looked at a couple of companies. Uh, when I looked at SageWorks, it, what was so shocking uh, to me, and it was a shock. I can use that term. That um, the the screens that I had set up, the worksheets that I had set up in the Excel program were just almost identical to the, the screenshots, the, the, the analysis that were in SageWorks. And I said, well, you know, I, uh, I can relate to this. Now, obviously, you know, the, the, what was happening in the background in SageWorks was just so much, much more complicated and complex and, um, than, than what I had in Excel. The, the reports came out very similar. And uh, as I looked more into it and got the demonstration, he said, uh, this is the one. You know, we like this one. The aspect of uh, SageWorks that, that I find really good is, is that when, uh, when we're on a day-to-day -day basis, we're reviewing a loan, and we decided that we need to risk rate that loan or classify that loan a certain way, or if we need to impair the loan, uh, we can go ahead and input that information in SageWorks right then, and, and it's there. Uh, otherwise, with, with the prior process, we had to keep a record of it, had to make notes, we had to remember uh, at the end of the reporting period, you know, well, well, you've got this loan, you've got to incorporate. But uh, with SageWorks, you do it uh, at the time it occurs, it's in there, you don't have to worry about it. When you go and pull the reports uh, or, or review the numbers, you know, they're already there and just a, a little tweaking uh, makes, it, uh, makes it much easier. After having used the Excel program for, well, at least six years, uh, there was an era that, that was after we got into the SageWorks and ran, the, after I ran the first SageWorks analysis, I got to comparing and just kind of a parallel there. And uh, there was a number uh, right on the first page that uh, was rather glaring and stood out at the time uh, and I said, you know, well, why haven't I seen this all along? With the Excel program, uh, as I mentioned before, it was, it was kind of a, a single purpose, single use. We, uh, we were seeking or wanting the, the reserve uh, balance number, and, and that's what the program gave me. That's what the Excel program. Uh, there's such a, a much broader um, usage of SageWorks in that uh, the, the dynamics of it. Uh, with all of the data within SageWorks and however uh, the, the uh, formulations are in the background, I mean it's just a point and click and you know, we can uh, segment uh, the, the numbers uh, most any way we want to uh, in terms of looking at a uh, you know, list of non-accruals, we can look at TDRs, we can look at uh, loans by classification, by risk rating. Uh, you know, and pull those out in groups. That's in addition to the management reporting uh, that's found uh, in, in, uh, within the software. Anytime we go and look at the numbers, they're there, they're available. And where we didn't have that, uh, if we wanted to look at an interim calculation, say within a quarter, uh, if we wanted to do it on a monthly basis, which our CEO does like to see that, um, it would, we would have to run all of those core reports and put those manually into the Excel program and then run it. Um, so, you know, significant savings of time there over a, over a quarter uh, period. But, um, you know, the, with SageWorks, it, it's all there. In, the numbers are there inside the software and available just with a few clicks of the button. Before we made the transition fully uh, from the Excel to, to the SageWorks, uh, we wanted to do two things. And uh, one was uh, we wanted to run parallel. We wanted to run the, the program parallel just uh, to see how close the numbers uh, computed. 
And uh, we did that. And the other thing, we asked our um, external um, accounting firm, auditing firm, to come in and take a look at it. So um, uh, one of their guys uh, was, was willing to do that. He's, he's kind of a, he, he has a real strong interest in, in that. He, he likes to deal with software products and look at the different ones and see how they work. And so he came in and, and actually spent a full day uh, with the two of us. And he said, great. He said, I'm good with this. He said, this is a good program, good software. Um, you know, I'll sign off on it. 